What is up everyone? It's Demolition Mushroom Derby for Life. I'm going to be hauling in scrap load number five, I think it is now. Uh, this one is actually one that I picked up from one of my neighbors. I think I, I paid 50 bucks for the car. I didn't, there was no CAD on it, so that kind of was a bummer. But with scrap being up right now, that's perfect. I can at least make my money back and then some. But I basically stuffed this thing full. I got the van that's in the shop, and then one of the vans over there, I got both the back seats out of them, and like, or all the rear seats, I got out of both vans, and then any garbage or any crap that was in it stuffed into this car. So those uh, two vans are starting to look pretty good now. And I'm pretty stoked on getting those further along. Uh, I got about a month and a half to get them done. But you guys ready to see uh, this hunk of junk? I picked this thing up uh, probably a few months ago. It's a 98, I think, Grand Am. Uh, this thing is nothing special. They're mo uh, it was a parts vehicle. Uh, the neighbors took quite a few stuff off. I kept the aluminum rims. Uh, I'm starting to scrap everything kind of separately. Uh, the radiator I pulled out, condenser I pulled out, and basically anything worthwhile to scrap separately I did. But for the most part, uh, as you can tell, she is stuffed full. Um, I don't think I, I could probably fit some more stuff in there, but I don't really have anything laying around at the at this point in time. Still a slop hole, which kind of sucks, but oh well. Um, I think I left the gas tank on here. Yeah, it's still on. Um, so they're not going to like that too much because I stuffed this thing full and they have to take the tank out. I should have done that, but oh well. Uh, they should be able to flip this car on the side and pop the tank out other than these uh seats so <laughs> i kind of like playing jenga so that that's kind of what i do with these vehicles when i stuff them full i try to get as much as i can into them so it's kind of like playing jenga so everything's got to fit in a certain way to get as much as you can in there but like i have like two two seats here or two bench seats here and then the the seat cushion out of this car stacked on top stuffed everything else loose wise up front and then i stacked the seats i put the bench uh the bu uh, bu bucket seats normal and then i stuffed this on there and then i'll tie this down and i'll tie that all together and i'll just throw a couple str I'll strap over the front strap over the middle and that should be good enough for the haul it in but basically, I stuffed this thing as full as I could get it. Um, uh, kind of, kind of sucks that uh, this car was basically junk. But it'd be kind of fun to see how these would do. Uh, you would have to swap out all the, uh, like the aluminum spindles and stuff. But for the most part, it's got a steel sub, so it wouldn't be too bad to swap all that stuff out. But I know this one had a lot of bad parts on it too. And the whole all the rockers and everything were gone and and yeah. But yeah, I got those two or I got that van and the other van over there. I got those kind of cleaned up at least. So I got majority of the uh garbage out of them. I didn't find anything too interesting, so so yeah, but yeah, everything is stuffed full in there. But the next time you guys see this car, it's going to be playing the claw game. Hunk of junk.